Hi guys and welcome to live event uh, blaster review. Uh, this is a desktop software uh, for basically creating live events on YouTube. If you've never heard of live events before, um, these are basically uh, something that Google and YouTube prefer for ranking. So basically if you just upload your video to YouTube, um, uh, it will be inferior to if you create a live event with the same video. Okay, so when you go to YouTube, you click on your channel icon over here and you go to the uh, creator uh, studio I don't know what it's called in English but it's uh, this over here this tab over here you click on that then you go to live stream over here this is in my native language that's why you can't understand it but it's the same thing and over here uh, you click on events and then you can create a, a new live event and for this is usually used a, a software called Wirecast and uh, the live event blaster is another software uh, for this uh, purpose so basically your video will rank much higher if you create a live event than if you just upload it to YouTube and do all the you know keywords and tags and uh, whatnot okay so this is what the software looks like what you have to do first is add an account over here and there's a description how to do that you have to go so uh, what I did uh, just now go to creator studio go to live events uh, step 3 you click on get started then you copy this link over here so we have we went to live uh, creator studio live events and all that and now I'm going to uh, copy the link that uh, I got from there then you have to log in to your uh, account via Google so this is the account I'm on then you click on allow then you copy this code that you got you go back to the previous window from the live event blaster and you copy it right over here and you click on add my account and this will you have successfully added Stormy Gym account that's my uh, offline business account and now you go to the add new item and you put your title description tags keywords and you can select the date when you want to um, uh, the live event to start you have a thumbnail file uh, that's be your thumbnail image from a video and of course your video file and then just click uh, add new item over here I would just like to point out something uh, regarding keywords over here I'm gonna play you the tutorial video that mentions this so I hope you can hear it let's go just a little bit over here and listen up now we can enter a keyword. This keyword will be used by Live Event Blaster to trace the rank on YouTube. What it will do, it will search on YouTube with your given keyword and tell you if your live event is ranking or not on that specific keyword. Okay, hope you, you got that. Um, so you know, just uh, put your um, event title here, description, tags and keyword. And that's basically it, you click on add new item what's gonna happen then is this just okay so let's just skip to the tutorial video again and all you have to do now is click on add new item and that's it the item is in your list now as you can see in the posted column there is a yellow X this means that the events are not posted on YouTube yet so what we need to do now is click on update and check the option Upload Unpublished Items and click Start. Alright, so as you can see we published our first item. Of course, if you want, you can publish all items at once. Simply select them all and click on Update. But in this case, I only published the first item. Now, if we enlarge the date column, we will see that the stream will start at about 3.25 p.m. That's about in one hour. If you want to start the stream right now, simply click on the item, right click and start live streaming. Okay, I have to point out something over here. When you s uh, schedule the stream like this, your laptop and the live event blaster have to be running. Okay, so you actually have to open up your laptop and uh, uh, start up the live event blaster, which sort of, in my opinion, defeats the purpose of the software because you know in that case you can just go on and uh, you know since you already opened up your laptop and started the software you might as well create a live event and upload it like that 
what the creator of the software says that you can uh, create you can upload this uh, uh, the software so this software over here you can upload it uh, the line vein blaster on your uh, virtual private server there are no tutorials on how to upload the software on your uh, virtual uh, private server but I suggest that it definitely that it's something to definitely be added to the tutorials because I don't know how to do that and I'm guessing that most of you don't uh, know how to do that so perhaps you know I, I can tell you but perhaps this will be added to the tutorials to the tutorial section uh, which by the way uh, looks like this training video here and then there are some images here and hopefully there will be uh, something more um, added to this uh, help section a couple of more things uh, to point out in the software first uh, this is the I think the basic version so this allows only one account and uh, Stoika the creator says that he will uh, be implementing the multiple accounts feature in the pro version but uh, you know it, it isn't ready yet he's just uh, planning to do that so I'm not sure this will be uh, done uh, in time for the launch but I guess it will be uh, one of the updates and definitely in the 2.0 version you know um, one more thing that's missing here in my opinion when you are creating an event is the location service um, something that you can do on YouTube is when you go here you create this is your basic info the title the description the tags then you have your advanced settings over here you can click your uh, category category here and then you can choose your location here so if I uh, you know choose my hometown I can rank a uh, video very easily with this um, for local businesses in my town for restaurants you know whatever and this is something that's not here in the live event blaster and it is also something that uh, Stoika the uh, developer is planning to add uh, I guess in the pro version but as I said already it's not uh, ready at this moment uh, so it will probably uh, be ready um, perhaps by the launch but more, more likely in one of the updates so just so you know so that's basically it uh, you add all, everything here a new item uh, we can go back to tutorial video over here in just a second right click and start live streaming A window will open and we will need to wait until the streaming starts. It can take up to one minute before the stream starts. So just be patient. So just be patient and wait until the stream starts. That's basically it. Um, some more benefits for a live event blaster uh, um, that you can, uh, you know, um, you can track all your live streams and uh, the rankings and views it got something that uh, you know I can't do when I'm doing it manually on uh, on YouTube but uh, as I said before some of the dislikes for me is the lack of multiple accounts here and you know there's no uh, location there's no location uh, feature over here and uh, also you know you have to open up your laptop and start up a live event blaster if you want uh, you know the schedule event to actually occur or you can set it up on your virtual virtual private server, server which I don't know how to do <laughs> so there you go that's it for this review hope you liked it and I'll see you next time